Hello, Holulipa here. This video is just to provide yet another example on how pseudoscience permeates the internet and feed on ignorance of people. A year and a half ago, I made a video related to the triangle of life, a technique in trying to survive an earthquake. The reason why I made a couple of earthquake related videos was because at that time, in my island, it has just happened a major earthquake that affected Haiti and was felt in all our side of the island. And just after that earthquake, we continued to feel very strong aftershocks. In the Dominican Republic, when it comes to dealing with earthquake, we have a different situation than that of a developed country. Construction regulation is not as strong as in other countries. Therefore, our houses and buildings are not as well built as a house or a building in a developed country. Based on this fact, some protection techniques that might work in a first world country might not work here. Being sympathetic with that situation, I decided to make a guide on how to behave and protect yourselves and your loved ones in case of a major earthquake. This video was entirely produced in Spanish. In the video, after explaining how an earthquake works, I gave some instructions and ideas on how to behave in an earthquake. Of course, I did recommend people to use the well-tested and proven working method of drop, cover, and hold. The methods like standing in a doorway, running outside, and the triangle of light are considered dangerous and are not recommended not only by the institution in charge of these matters in our countries, but also international organizations. To my first video, some people said that the better procedure was the triangle of life, and I made a second video debunking the triangle of life method, based on that its creator was dishonest when doing research, and also having discovered a couple of papers, concluded that drop, cover, and hold was a faster and better technique than the triangle of life. Well, today, the creator of that method, Mr. Dot Cobb, left a message in the comment section of that video, calling me a stupid and mentioning some kind of conspiracy being carried out by financial interest who wanted children to die, also calling me to shame on myself and telling me that hell was waiting for me because I was helping to kill them for profit. Little did I know when I made this video that this topic in particular about using the triangle of life instead of the traditional protection method during earthquake had a controversy just like evolution and creation or climate change and climate change denialist. That video received a huge amount of comments calling me all kinds of names and doing all kinds of ad hominem attacks rather than talking about the topic which had research showing that it was a failed method for protecting during an earthquake. This fringe group of people have taken into the social networks and have promoted this method among countries outside the United States or Europe, and they have been very successful since they don't need to provide any kind of evidence of the efficacy of this method they have built a cult-like group of followers. I don't know how this generates money for Mr. Cobb, but it seems that it does, because I think he patented this method. So there must be some kind of benefit for him. The important thing here is that this method has been highly criticized by the United States Geological Service and others organizations that deal with earthquake protection. And there is also some studies that do not recommend this kind of method. This study that I also mentioned in the video is the one prepared by Matt Davifor et al. in 2010, which compare in detail both methods, considering its application, the amount of people that each method can reach, and the simplicity in implementing it, the probability of reducing death and injury in underdeveloped countries like Iran. The paper sustained that the already known method of drop, cover, and hold on is far more effective in these countries than other methods proposed, including the triangle of life. Time in implementing playing a very important role in this decision, 
because as I showed in my video on an earthquake in a matter of seconds a building could be destroyed which does not leave any time to find out a proper place and implement the triangle of life procedure therefore they determined it was very difficult to prove its efficacy whereby the traditional drop cover and hold method could be easily tested and in all tests demonstrated its efficacy and i show that in my video it seems that that affect the interest of mr cobb and hence the comment he made on my video since this was a relatively unknown pseudoscience method that could affect the lives of people. I would appreciate if you spread the word debunking this type of useless method and promoting the one that works. Thank you for your attention.